Hello, and I'd like to thank you for coming to my channel. Now, today I'm going to be talking about the 3100CN is being not supported for Windows 8. I have this printer, and I actually have Windows 10. It's also not supported for Windows 10. If you look here, the 3130 supported. 3115 is supported. 3110 is supported, but the 3100 is not, the 3010 is not, and the 3000 is not supported. Now I have, I actually have the 3100CN, and I have Windows 10, and I'm like, how can I get my printer to work? I found that I could print using Firefox, but anything else I tried printing from Windows would make the application crash. So I was like, how can I make this work for everything? So I started doing searches. And over here it says it says it's not uh it will not work on it is what this here says from Microsoft support. And here at the bottom, the last person, what do they tell you? It is not supported. A new printer will probably be cheaper than the value and time you will waste trying and failing to make this work. I speak from experience. Well, this person here must not have tried that hard because I didn't even try that hard. And I was looking around, and I found this driver right here, which is Dell OpenPrint Driver. Now, we're going to look at the OpenPrint Driver here. If you look here, Compatible Systems, it does not list our 3100CN here at all as being a compatible uh, device. But I downloaded the driver anyway, and I tried it. And once you get it downloaded, it's going to be like in a zip file called Software OpenPrint. PD Dell. I have version A11 Win. You, you double click on the uh, piece here. We accept it. We're going to tell it to install everything. File oriented. It says download from the internet. Now I have this uh, printer set up as a network printer hooked up directly to my router. And the thing is, it's not going to be, it's not going to find my printer. It will never find it. But there's a trick to make it find it. I know the direct IP address for my printer, which is, I have mine set up as 192. 168.1.103 now you can do this from your printer itself you can actually set up an IP address if you're actually printing from that type of location and since I know this I just click the arrow and if you look here it says Dell laser printer and it says upstairs that's I changed I made the name of that printer upstairs a long long time ago and I forgot I did that I've moved since then so I'll probably need to go out and change that. If you look here, it lists my MAC address. It says generic laser printer for the model is what it's finding it as. Even though it says generic laser printer, this driver here will make it work. And it says status. Canon toner. I know it's going to say Canon toner low once I go to it. And now all we do is we click OK. And if you look here, it says uh, name, Dow Laser Printer, 3100CN. Then it says model, generic laser printer. Now it's going to make, now the printer will work, but it shows up as a generic laser printer. Now if I come over here, let's say to uh, let's say I'm just going to go to this random page. I'm going to say print. I need to go down here to Dell Open Printer. And if you look here, bam, right away it comes up asking you how you want to set it up and everything. Now if we try to use the original drivers for the 3100, which I already have installed up here, if you look, we could not reach this printer. But if we use the Dell Open Print,
and if I click print right here you can see it, it was it's being sent to my printer and right now it says printing and it shows printing to my printer and that's how you get the Dell 3100 to work now some applications like you try to print from let's say let me come over here to my pictures real quick let's say I come over here to this printer I mean this picture here the one that says where's the fat man trying to drown out or waterboard the uh, the elf I click on print if you look here it gives me a choice of printing out in color or monochrome more settings Now we're going to go over here, we're going to select the Dell 3100CN. If you look here, it says we could just not reach your printer. Now the problem I had with this before is, if I tried to print this up, it would actually would make the application crash. So I had to use the Dell Open Print Driver to make it work. Now, if you found this uh, video useful, please click like and subscribe. Thank you.